football we're talking about last night's game. Let's speak to Leon, a Man City fan. Hello, Leon. Hello. How are you? How are you, love? I'm good, thank you. Yourself? I'm good. Before we talk football, are you Android or iPhone? Always, always, always been Android. I can't stand iPhone. One nil. I'll write that down for okay, you. Okay, write it down, uh, baby. Okay. Simply because uh, with iPhone, they are limited with their apps, whereas Android share their apps with all Androids. I don't even know what you've just said, but it's the word share with all of them <laughs> sounds quite good, so I quite like that. Uh, yeah. Leon, you're a Man City fan. Did you go last night? No, I watched it with my dad in my living room, and I must have had about five heart attacks watching that game. <laughs> it was, I mean, listen, the, neither, I haven't got a dog in the fight, so neither team of mine, but yeah. I just couldn't take my eyes off it. It was fantastic. I thoroughly enjoyed yeah. it. Yeah, absolutely brilliant from start to finish. The fact that we set the record for the fastest goal in semi-final history... With, with, what, just under two minutes to score? Mm. Leon, I mean, I guess the, the only negative, maybe, was that you should be going into the second leg with more than a goal lead. I'm not afraid of going, going there with one goal lead because if my memory serves me right, the last team to go to the... English team to go to the Bernabeu and win was us and we won 3-1 with a De Bruyne penalty as yeah, well. Yeah, but I, th- I think when you get to the second leg semi-final of the Champions League, uh, you know... With all due respect, I think stats go out the window, Leon. Oh, yeah, I agree with that. But, like I say, we've already done it once. I'm, I'm not afraid of going there and doing it again. I'm confident that we'll go there and win. OK. I mean, effectively, you're going there with a 1-0 lead, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and that's good enough to get you into the yeah. final. I think, I think both teams will score there. But I think we'll come out on top. OK, all right. Thanks for that, Leon. Let's go to John's a Man City fan. Hello, John. Hey guys, you okay? Oh, good. Before we get to the game, are you Android or iPhone? Samsung A32 can't go wrong. Android. Oh, Two Android. Yeah, Android, Android. Yeah. You mean I should turn? Uh, you should come out, yeah, definitely. I should come, come out, on, yeah. yeah. Okay, well, uh, maybe, yeah. maybe I will. I don't mind. I'm not embarrassed, too, John. Good man. Good okay. man. Go on. You're a City fan. Did you go? Yes, always there. Uh, always there. Uh, what was it like? What, what was it like being there, um, John? It's, it's like opportunity missed. We should have put that game to bed in the first half. It should have been done, dusted. On to the next one, thank you very much. And the next one should just be a formality because we absolutely battered him. Uh, but we shot when we should have passed. We passed when we should have shot. Mm. It, it, I don't get it. And that's been profligate all season, guys. Let me tell you, that has been happening all season. The wrong decision right at the decisive moment. Um, but I mean, can't take anything away. It was like it's like watching Hearns and Hagler in the pump. Two boxes it was. stood mm, there, it was. trading, trading. What an what an advert. I mean, I, I've got a dog in the fight, but for a neutral, that's a great game of football to watch. And it was end to end, and it was relentless, and it was played high octane, high skill levels. Uh, I think we'll go there. I think we will get the result, um, and I think we will progress to the final. C- but can, I think we could have made it. Can I just I think sorry, we Benny? Can I just ask, John, if away goals counted, you'd be more worried, obviously, wouldn't you? Yeah, like you say, we're going into the the, the, the next stage of the tie with a 1-0 advantage, aren't we? As it happens, well, I know it's 4-3, but we're, we're 1-0 up on the, on the tie, aren't we? Mm. So, yeah, if it was an away goal scenario, then obviously it's, it's, it makes it a little bit more even, doesn't it? But that, that being said, we, we, we know what we've got to do. Pep doesn't change his game plan. He'll go there 4-3-3. And he will attack from the get go. Um, John, and John, that takes. John, are you a little bit worried though Sorry. about defensive, uh, about the defensive problems. You had a few injuries there. John Stones, unfortunately, uh, maybe Carl Walker will be back. You're not a little bit concerned about what you're going to do defensively. Bentley, you nailed it because Vinicius Junior would never have attempted that against nope, Carl Walker. No chance. Carl Walker. Carl Walker. The older he gets, the faster he gets. I don't get it. Oh, he, he, would, he, he still would have right. attempted it. John. No, he wouldn't have. He wouldn't have. He wouldn't. He wouldn't, he wouldn't have. have done because he, he, he would have put, instead of him um, dummying the ball and running off and round, he, 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 if you're going to go in a straight uh, foot race with uh, Kyle Walker, you're coming off second and I don't care who you are. I mean, Usain Bolt would just about beat him because he's that fast. <laughs> um, so that being said, he wouldn't have attempted that. But when you're going up against Fernandinho, the makeshift, then you're going to try Of course you are. Why wouldn't you? Um Guy Walker's a massive miss to us, but you're saying who's our most important player? Now mm. I'm going to give you the name, guys, and you're not going to, you're going to go, wow, Rodrigo. Sets yeah. the tempo, sets the rhythm. The, the most, the most important. If yeah, if he's not in the, 
I'll, I'll give you the scenario. If Kevin De Bruyne goes out, Gun Dog comes in, and we can replace it. Kevin De Bruyne is the best midfield player at this moment in Europe, if not the world, end of. But the most important player to the way Pep plays is Rodrigo. He sets the tempo of the rhythm. He puts the blanket mm-hmm. up in front of the defence and he, he, he puts his foot in and he starts the play. He sets the play, sets the tempo and rhythm. Knock him out of his stride. When he's not, tell you what, we miss him more if he's not in the team because we don't have a direct replacement for him, whereas we can, we can manage without any of the others. Do you know what, John? John, you, you've, got, you've, you've got a point there because when you think about the Champions League final, they went in there with no holder. Look what happened. Chelsea, yeah. Chelsea dominated, but I mean, Rodri, he's come on leaps and bounds. Some of the goals he scored this season, by the way, he hit mm. one a couple of weeks ago, didn't he? I can't remember if it was against. Absolute corker. But I think he's improved season upon season. But I guess working with someone like Fernandinho, watching how he's operated, having him kind of in the background, giving him pointers, and that's probably mm. going to help. 